Today's headlines. Top 10 news you don't want to miss. Don't forget to subscribe to keep up with the latest news. COVID. England to require negative test for arrivals from China. The UK says it is acting over concerns about infection data provided by the Chinese government. Trump news. Live. Trump tax returns reveal web of losses. Write-offs. Disguised gifts, and little charity. Former president's tax returns also show he had bank accounts in China, the UK, and Ireland. S&P 500 closes out dismal year with worst loss since 2008. Stocks are closing out 2022 with more losses, giving the S&P 500 its worst year since 2008. The benchmark index fell 0.3% Friday, the last trading day of the year, leaving it down 19.4% for the year. Idaho murders. What we know about suspect Brian Christopher Koberger. Brian Koberger was arrested in connection with the gruesome November murders of four college students. Tennessee tops Clemson in Orange Bowl to cap best year since. 01. Tennessee matched its best record since 2001, rolling past Clemson 31-14 in the Orange Bowl on Friday to finish the season at 11-2. Barbara Walters, legendary news anchor, has died at 93. Barbara Walters, the pioneering TV journalist whose interviewing skills made her one of the most prominent figures in broadcasting, has died. Her spokesperson confirmed to CNN. She was 93. Hershey's sued in U.S. after study found heavy metals in its dark chocolate. A lawsuit filed in New York State alleges that Hershey's fails to disclose that some of its chocolate products contain unsafe levels of lead and cadmium. U.S. Supreme Court Justice's wife disavows her texts. Virginia Thomas's remarks are among a mountain of transcripts released by the U.S. Capitol riot. Inquiry. Abortion in Arizona. 15-week law goes into effect. Doctors can't be charged over 1864 ban. Appeals court rules. The Arizona Court of Appeals ruled on Friday the state's law outlawing abortion after 15 weeks can go into effect. Lakers vs. Hawks final score. LeBron James delivers historic game. It was a vintage masterpiece from LeBron James on his 38th birthday as he led the Lakers to a victory in Atlanta with 47 points.